Hi, I am Kazuki Shimada, a co-investigator of JPP study. The prevention of atherosclerotic cardiovascular disease is an important public health priority in Japan. The objective of this study is to determine whether aspirin reduces the incidence of cardiovascular disease in elderly Japanese patients with multiple risk factors. The study design was a probe design. Approximately 15,000 patients were recruited from nationwide 1,007 primary care physicians clinic, aged 65 to 80 years. And the, uh, the patients were randomized one to one to one daily low dose 100 milligram aspirin and no aspirin. The composite primary endpoint is the cardiovascular death and non fatal myocardial infarction and non fatal stroke. And the secondary endpoint was the individual primary endpoint plus extra serious extracranial bleeding requiring transfusion or hospitalization. The study was prematurely uh, discontinued uh, due to the recommendation by data Monit monitoring committee based on likely fertility. The five-year primary endpoint event rate was not significantly different between two groups. The hazard ratio was uh, 0.94, .9, thus the aspirin uh, reduced, in uh, reduced the primary endpoint insignificantly by 6%. As for secondary endpoints, the aspirin treatment reduced the non-fatal MI significantly by 47% and trans transient ischemic attack significantly by 43%, while aspirin increased the incidence of serious extracranial bleeding by 85%. So we conclude that the once daily low dose aspirin 100 mg to Japanese elderly patients with multiple risk factors did not reduce the incidence of cardiovascular disease. And now we are planning to identify the population who may benefit most with aspirin. And also we are investigating the uh, relationship uh, with aspirin and uh, with, asp uh, with aspirin treatment and cancer incidence in this population. Thank you very much.